Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for May 5th of 2023. Well, it is titled Shackleton from Shadow Cam. So what do we see here? Well, this is an image of Shackleton Crater, which is near the south pole of the moon. Now, some craters near the lunar poles are in permanent shadow. They never see direct sunlight because of the crater walls and the way the moon is positioned. The craters ascent, the, the crater wall essentially shields the interior of that crater from ever being in uh, viewed in direct sunlight. What that means is that these are places where we could look for water on the moon. Now we normally would not expect to find water on the moon. It has no atmosphere. So liquid water would be completely impossible. You could have water ice, but the intense heat of the sun on the moon with nothing to modify it would vaporize that and the lunar gravity would not be able to hold it as a gas. So any water of ice would then escape out into space and be gone. However, in craters like this one that are shielded, water ice could still exist. Now, this is potential for being able to access water for perhaps future lunar visits or lunar settlements, that there would be some water that could be accessed directly on the moon, meaning it did not have to be transported from Earth. Um, so what we're looking at this from this is looking from shadow cam, which is a NASA device on the Korea Pathfinder lunar orbiter, which was launched in August of last year, and is many times more sensitive than the old lunar reconnaissance orbiters cameras. So it brings up more detail and is also designed to be able to look at those regions that are permanently shadowed such as this one. Now we say it's permanently shadowed and then you may wonder how are we seeing it if it's permanently shadowed? Well, what we see is indirect sunlight. So light is still scattered around and may bounce on and off and on other objects and still illuminate this much as the uh, moon is illuminated in Earth's shadow or we can see the moon shining by Earth's shine when we look at a thin crescent moon. The rest of the moon can be there faintly faintly visible because of reflected light that gets into what would otherwise be a completely shadowed area. Now, if you're wondering what the arrow is pointing to, you see that track rolling down the side of the crater that was caused by one boulder as it moved down there as it rolled down the crater wall. So material will fall on the moon much like on Earth eventually gravity will tip things over slow erosion uh, due to micrometeorite impacts and slight things like this are the only things that change the moon surface over the times that we see them pretty much the moon otherwise is completely inactive at this point. So that was our picture of the day for May 5th of 2023. It was titled Shackleton from Shadow Cam. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.